gonna try and be really quick. I don't have enough space on my phone to be long, so I kind of don't have a choice. And Bentley's got his tablet on and is making a mess in front of me. So excuse all the background noise. He's only been up for like what time is it? Ten thirty. He's only been up for like twenty minutes. It's incredible. It's ten thirty already. So I got a new planner yesterday at Walmart. I'm obsessed with it. Um giant the front says plans are dreams in the making so inside for july you know you got the full calendar view and then i have like a daily view so the first second third fourth fifth i definitely wrote on the wrong like i was intending to start writing on this page and i definitely didn't so I'm doing like a test run basically on Friday the 5th, even though it's actually um, the 19th today. So I'm playing with how I want to set it up and then I'll actually write it on today's date. But wow. so I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit about it and how I'm going to start like really running things for myself. Um, especially because I'm about to move and that's going to just give me such a better setup. Um, but so here's how I did Friday. So I know this is backwards, but so I want to have 10 enrollments today. So got the 10 spots. So I can check them off and write their name. Um, the other thing that I really like about this is that then like, in two weeks, I can flip back to today's date once I put it on the right date. I can flip back to today's date and be like, okay, these people signed up. They should all have their products by now. Let me message them. And that's going to be incredible for me. And then I can, like, August, I can be like, okay, hey, today's the 19th. Let me flip back. Or, like, yeah, so, like, today's the 15th. Let me flip back to this week in July and see who all's orders are about to run this week kind of situation. So... Um, and then, like, at three months, I can be like, let me go back three months and see who all has now completed their 90-day challenge. And let me talk to them about starting a new 90-day challenge or where they're at with their goals or whatever. Like, it's just going to help me follow up with my cust my actual customers. Not potentials, but my actual customers so much better. So, I am pushing for a lot of volume before the month's over. And, uh... So I have that every hour I want to send 30 messages on each Facebook and Instagram. So I intend to like every hour on the dot start that. And so for Instagram, I'm just going to go through my followers list and I'm messaging about my hair, skin and nails challenge. So being like, um, hey, I have one spot available looking for someone that wants to grow out their hair. Are you interested? So I'm going to do that. And then for the Facebook messages, it's going to be, hey, um, I'm pushing for a really big goal this month um something along those lines um are you willing to make copy and paste post for me if so i'll enter you into my free fitbit drawing because that's what my team is doing this month um and then i have power hours hey, please don't hit me i have power hours so i'm going to start doing three power hours a day so the two different colors are two different power hours so the first one, and these are personal to me. Like, this is what I need to do for my business kind of thing. So normally in the first one, I would have happy birthdays, but I've already done them today. So I'm not including it because it's already done. So for you, if you need it, then put it in there. So the first one, I have read one chapter from my book. I am reading... Uh, I don't know where I put it. Really, is it behind you? Oh, yep, here it is. I am reading um, right now The Power of a Praying Parent because it's just, it's something that I just really needed in my life. Um, and then I'm going to move on to other books. So Girl, Wash Your Face. I've got three or four personal development books that I ordered. Um, I have this app. Um, let me see if it says it. Yeah, it's called Thrift Books. Um, so if you want to order from Thrift Books too, let me know and I'll send you a referral code. And I think it gets us both a discount. Um, but basically I got five books shipping everything they're used. And it was like 
not even $15 if I remember correctly. So anyway, so I'm going to start reading a chapter a day from whichever book I'm on. So my first power is read one chapter, add 20 Facebook friends, uh, put a product story up, go live, and message all my credit card to clients. Then my second power hour is add 20 more Facebook friends, product post, uh, a normal story, follow 200 on Instagram, and re-message everyone that commented on a host of posts for June and, oh. for July and then like going all the way back through June. Um, so there's not very many tasks in those two power hours because they take longer. So like going live, that's going to be 10, 15 minutes probably. Um, messaging all those comments from July and June, like that's probably going to take a good 20 plus minutes. So they're smaller amounts of power hour tasks, but they take longer. Um, and then I'm going to do a third power hour, but I'm not doing it until I get that far because, I mean, I could, throughout the day today, make an opportunity story before I even hit the power hour. So if I write that in the power hour, then I'm like, ugh, I already did that. So I won't write out what my third power hour will be until after I have, um, please stop kicking me. So we're here being a terror. You say Hi. He's officially 19 months old. Um, so I won't write out my third power hour until I've done the first two because I just I want them to be the most productive to me as they can be. So hang on, we'll go eat breakfast in just a second. So like I said, it's broken up into three sections. So I'm going to play with what I just showed you guys for the next like a week or so. Um, obviously, I won't always be like, oh, I want 10 enrollments today. Cause, I mean, that's a very great Friday thing, but like two or three on the other days. Bentley, please stop kicking me to just like keep myself accountable. Um, or like at least leave space for like up to five in case it was like an awesome day kind of thing. Um, but doing these other tasks are going to help me to be signing customers daily. You want to get down? Okay, here, give me your hand. Okay, go play. He's about to freak out because he's off the bed and he's going to want to come back on the bed. But anyways, so I'm going to start doing that. And then as soon as I move, probably, because it's just, I'm going to have like more space and better setup and all that. I'm going to start, I'm going to do a power hour in the morning before Bentley gets up. I'm going to do a power hour at nap and a power hour when he goes to bed. So that is three hours a day of intentional working. That is three hours a day of like I put everything else on hold and did my business. So that's how I'm going to go about this. Um, when I have potentials, I talk to them and I'm just like, how much time can you do about this a week? And they're like, oh, you know, like 20, 30 hours. I'm home all day, whatever. And it's like, okay, so you can do at least a couple hours a day. But then think about your business. Are you sitting down and working a few hours a day? Or are you like dragging it out all day long, feeling like you're on your phone 24 <laughs> seconds? Hey, like, go play, honey. Go play. Where's your poof? Go get your poof. He's got this giant poofy pillow he loves. Um, but if you're feeling like you're working this all day, then like change something. Do something different. Um, get a schedule for you that works. I mean, there are teachers in the company. Like, they can't touch their phone all day long. And they're still successful with this. You don't have to be on your phone all day long to be successful with this. So come up with a schedule that works for your life. And if you, there's not a power hour available or you don't want to do whatever tasks someone else says, then make your own power hour. Like you don't have to be on a group to do a power hour. You can do it all by yourself. And then if you do better working with a bunch of people, find people that are willing to get on a working hour. So a working hour where everyone's kind of on, where like you got a little bit of music in the background maybe, you've got, you know, chit chat a little bit, but you're all doing your own tasks. Find some of those. There's tons of them. Um, the uh, Exploding to Emerald page, I'm sure you can find people any time of day that want to jump on and get some work done. So this is what I'm starting to do. Um, I'm super excited because I also got... Um, where it's it. I had all this stuff like under the blankets and I couldn't grab it. I also got these inserts that go into um, my new planner um, and I can show you them. So they're 
So you put the date on the top and then it's broke down by hour. So starts at 6 a.m. and goes to 7.30 p.m. So you could easily like shift to the times if you're like need different times or whatever. Um, and then on the back it has um, top priorities, get it done, and take note. So I plan to like on the back of the, like on the front of it, anything that we have scheduled for that day, doctor's appointments, if I have to babysit, like anything for the day on that. And then on the back of it, um, get it done. So anything I need to do that day, if I need to clean out the van, if I need to do laundry, if I need to get something in the mail, I'm going to put it in the get it done because then I can check it off. And top priorities. So Mondays, my top priority is laundry. I get all of our laundry done on Mondays and then typically do another load or two towards the end of the week, like Thursday, Friday. But all the laundry I do on Monday. So that'd be a top priority on a Monday. Um, and it doesn't have to be anything crazy. Like if it's a day that I'm taking the kids to the King's Dominion, my top priority is go to King's Dominion. Like, so just make it be your life. Um, I got this planner, all this stuff at Walmart yesterday. Um, it's the Happy Planner. Um, and so all of, like this insert, um, the happy planner. Um, and then I also got a budgeting insert for it. Cause that's something that's important in my life right now. So it has like a savings goal thing. It has, um, bill pay checklist. It has, um, expense tracker um it has like this my month at a glance thing for the end there um month at a glance and so it has like all the bills and stuff and like what you thought it was going to be what it actually was stuff like that so i'm going to start like really tracking my budget and everything and paying off my debt better faster spending less extra money etc but so anyways so don't feel like you have to work this 24 7 like work smarter not harder and you'll be amazed at how much you can actually get done in a day and how much you can get done without being attached to your phone 24 7 like don't overwhelm yourself because oh i have to be available you don't you do not have to be available 24 7 like you just have to work every day. You have to actually show up and like clock in and do what you need to do kind of situation. But all right. Well, if anyone has any questions, I'm putting this up on my YouTube. So if anyone's not on my team, um, my name is Amanda Pitts. You can look me up on Facebook. I'm always open to messages, helping others, helping people that are not my downline, whatever. Um, so I just want to give those tips. Um, and anyone that's really confused right now, <laughs> um, I work for It Works. Um, it's an all natural health and wellness company. I am a double diamond with the company, and I'm a full time stay at home mom for my uh, my wow nine now 19 month old. He turned 19 months yesterday. But all right, so I will talk to you guys later. Message me with any questions.